Hey guys, GNT here, and man, this episode, because I'm, I'm going to hit this real quick, this episode was boring. <laughs> it was boring, and it felt like it took forever to finish. Like, when we got to the midway point, I thought the episode was over. I was like, oh, this is where it's going to end, because it had been dragging on for so freaking long. And that's kind of what I, I figured would happen last week. We'd get this episode, and it would just drag on wouldn't get any type of conclusion this week. And I know what some people are going to think, oh, well, we got some story in here. We we got, like, maybe two things that were kind of, uh, well, not even important. They were just explaining things that were going on. Like the, the freaking the blind chick was talking about how her and freaking Namura were in the same... Uh, they're in the same school type of, of swordsmanship. But apparently, you know, seeing as he didn't have a quote unquote teacher, <laughs> he's not very great. But they also explained the whole, um, Amo and her different type of fighting style, which basically makes her body into a sword. That was it. That's the only thing that you actually got out of this episode that would actually mean anything. The rest of it was just so dreadfully boring. Felt like a fluff episode. Like they didn't want to go past a certain part of the story in the manga. So they made the episode extra long. Kind of like with how last episode half of it was light and half of it was serious. With this episode, it just felt like it just was dragging for so freaking long. It felt like I sat and watched that show, that one episode, for an hour. By the time I got to the end, I was like, oh, hmm. Wow, I almost fell asleep. That was, yeah, was kind of dreary there. Like, the only thing that seemed pretty cool about the episode was the end. <laughs> Where he showed up and like grabbed Sukuyo and threw her back and headed forward and freeze frame end of episode. I think that chick's name was Sukuyo. Sukuyo, the blind chick. I don't know. I'm just I'm just guessing here. But yeah, overall, this episode was just uh It was kinda lame. Like, if if next episode is like this, <laughs> I might not even do a video on it. It's just, I don't know, because I only like talking about the episodes of shows that actually get me hyped or I really feel are worth it. This one, I did not. But because I've been consistent with this show, I just said I'd, I'd throw one up there. It's like that show Suka Suka. I, oh, man. One episode was just dreadfully boring, and it never hyped back up for me, so I haven't done anything about it since, but I still check it out, but it's it's not interesting enough for me to talk about it anymore. I just don't care. And I don't want this show to go that way, which I'm sure it won't. Like, next episode will actually have the fight, but this episode was not great. At least for a person like me that wants to keep stuff moving at a steady pace. This episode completely stagnated the story. It stayed it just... It's basically where it was at the end of the last episode. Except with a couple more people on the ground. <laughs> anyway. That's it for my thoughts on this episode. It was... Ugh. It was a 1.5 for me. It was not great. It was extremely boring. And I'd like for you guys to tell me exactly what you thought about this episode. I will see you next time. Peace out and have a great day.